My Save train riding and my feet. Let me get into this before we get into this. We're going to have to give you the context clues that we've seen in here because this is all we got. This is this video. This is it, right? Is that this black man was tending to his children and this white woman interjected in front of his children, undermining his authority, attempting to, and was telling him to chill out. And then... Say it to my face now. Tell me to take a chill pill. Tell me. Tell, say, say the word chill pill. In this, we do not promote anyone hitting women on a proactive tip. However, comma, we tell everyone, men, women, and children, if you have not a pair of well-formed testicles, don't be talking to people like you do. Oh! 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 She a female. What? That's OD. That's OD. I'm talking to you niggas in my black business. You understand? Mind your business. What? How do y'all niggas roll up in my fucking business? I'm dealing with my fucking kids. You understand? Mind your business. Mind your business, it ain't about being a role model, it's about getting my fucking respect from people like you. All these other races out here, mind your business. I never get you. Yeah. Man, I'm ready to fuck anything up that's in my business. So, so that's, that's me, how man. me is right there. Holler at me, man. And he let his what girlfriend thought, get robbed. What I thought, y'all niggas out here looking for victims, I'm a fucking <laughs> suspect, you understand? Oh, no. I do shit yeah, so the part that he was saying about him being a suspect and people in his business that, that everybody knows everybody already knows this is that when you're black you're never really alone they keep telling you about these absentee black fathers even though the cdc did a report about black men being the most involved in their children's lives and the funny thing the funny thing is that everybody was like well why did the cdc do the good year when if you know that it was a negative result they would have been running with it as gospel right but black men who are the most uninvolved according to them this brother was tending to his children well, karen interjects and he gets her shit rocked and now he's he's the bad guy now now, personally, personally, this is one of those instances where we would not have proactively struck her. She might have got spit on if, we, you know, a couple decades ago, she'd have caught us in the wrong move, especially over, you know what I mean? This whole scenario, them in our business, they tell us don't spank your kids, but when the kids are unruly, then they're like, oh, where are the parents? And then they want to blame parents when people do something, they're always looking. But the question we have is, what about all these white people? There was a whole insurrection and ain't nobody mentioned nobody's parents for these grownups, right? But when it's us, oh, it's the absentee fuck, but here he is standing up. Now he's, you know, you know, but now preferably again, if that was a man and he was rocking his, yeah, cool. And the dude that stood there, that somebody was, they were saying in the video that it was his chick and he just stood by and let it happen. We hope it's not his, but that's white man 101. Brothers normally are better than that, especially in a scenario, even if it was a stranger. Because personally, if it was a sister and she was in the, even if she was in the wrong, dude went to hit her. We we don't care where we're at. We would have passed. That's not breaking our vow of pacifism. We've already talked to the universe, the ancestors and everything to get that worked out. So anywho, you should know the drill by now. Like this, comment to add value. Send this to your people's followers account. Good talk. Glad we had it. R-E-X.